Welcome back to the Old Running Butcher Shop. My name is Greg. Once again, I'm your host for this evening. Uh, when last we spoke, we were talking turkey right around Thanksgiving time. We're going to celebrate the holidays by introducing you to our 12 roasts of Christmas. First in line is our rump roast this evening. Uh, it's a very affordable, very versatile roast. You um, can use it in the oven. It's very, very good for a pot roast as well, which means that it's very easy to put right on top of the stove. Uh, next roast in line is going to be a top round roast. Um, very, very similar to the um, back of the rump roast. However, it's from a little bit of a different cut and um, known to be a little bit leaner than your back of the, than your back of the rump. Um, next roast, third one in line, is a top sirloin. We're getting into the sirloin category, so we're talking great flavor here, great versatility, just a, a fabulous roast that you would have no trouble having all of your guests enjoy at the dinner table. Uh, we're going to switch scenes here a little bit and introduce you to a boneless pork loin roast. Um, just a, a exquisite roast. We tie it up, custom made for you. Uh, absolutely delicious, very easy to cook. 18 to 20 minutes to 18 to 20 minutes a pound at 325 degrees comes out absolutely fantastic. Um, its friend and neighbor is a boneless stuffed pork loin roast. We have two or two, two or three different varieties of stuffing that we can do for you. Everything from a um, an apple cranberry cornbread to an autumn harvest, which is a bit more savory. Uh, your choice, your decision. Um, we tie it up and cut it up according to the poundage that you need and uh, custom made as you request. Uh, next in line, finishing out our pork offerings, is our pork crown roast. Um, it's a 10 rib minimum. When you're considering something like this, probably want to consider one to two ribs per adult portion. Okay, next in line in our offerings of our 12 roasts of Christmas is our ever popular boneless turkey roast. This is, uh, it's a year round special. It's very, very popular around the holidays, obviously, but really at any time of year. Uh, what makes this probably very, very attractive to anybody who's looking at turkey is there's really no carving involved. This is pure white breast meat. Uh, it's a simple slicing, 325 degrees for about 20 minutes a pound, and you're gonna enjoy, enjoy an absolutely fabulous roast. Uh, right next to that is our boneless strip loin. Uh, which some people like to affectionately call a New York strip. Uh, this is done, again, according to poundage. Uh, half a pound to three quarters of a pound per person is what you really want to estimate when you're going to be serving something like this. Very, very lean. You want to cook this fat side up. Um, so you want all that meat to absorb all of those, uh, all of the juices from the fat, that from that fat cap on that roast. Uh, next is the most popular roast that we offer here. Uh, for the past six years, hands down, the New York Boneless, which we affectionately call our holiday roast, in some circles, it's called a spoon roast. Uh, no matter what you call it, it's wonderfully delicious, comes from the sirloin. I like to think it's a very forgiving roast. Uh, an extra five or 10 minutes in the oven really doesn't matter. You, you cannot beat this up at all. It's absolutely delicious. Uh, what you want, want to do when cooking this is start it out at probably 400 degrees for about 10 minutes. Get a nice beautiful sear on that, nice color, lock in the juices, and set your temperature down, after, uh, down to about 350 degrees after that for 18 to 20 minutes a pound. Um, next in line is our boneless ribeye roast. Some people call it a Delmonico, we just call it absolutely delicious. Probably the most flavorful roast uh, that you can even consider buying anywhere. Um, it is, uh, again, you're going to estimate this at probably about a half pound to three quarters of a pound per person. Um, you're cutting it uh, according to the butcher's twine that you're going to see right here. 
it's parallel to that and you're going to cut it to the thickness that each and every one of your guests is going to prefer. Uh, next in line is also a, um, a ribeye roast, but this is a bone-in prime rib. This actually having the bone attached has a significant amount of flavor, uh, probably a little bit more flavor than your boneless, believe it or not. We like to uh, offer this out um, in a process called cradling and tying. We very carefully and very precision-like separate out the entire bone section and tie it right back on directly where it was previously. By tying that back on and cooking it that way, you're getting the flavor of the bone while you're cooking it off. Um, when it's fully cooked and it then becomes a standing rib roast, you simply cut through that butcher's twine. Your bone will easy, a bone portion will easily fall off from that portion, from the main portion of the roast and you simply have an absolutely delicious ribeye or once again what some people affectionately call a Delmonico. Last in line, top rung of the ladder, pièce de résistance, the beef tenderloin roast. Um, you can cut this with a spoon. It is absolutely so tender, so scrumptious, so succulent. Uh, I have no other words to describe this. Uh, the only thing that you really need to take great care in is, is your cooking with this. Um, generally 14 to 16 minutes a pound at 325 degrees if you're looking at something rare. 16 to 18 if you're looking at medium, 18 to 20 if you're looking for something medium well. Uh, keep in mind with any of these roasts we have a complete roasting guide, we have a complete temperature guide. Uh, all of these roasts are available to order either online or by phone uh, right here at the store. Uh, you guys know where to find us, 169 Haven Street, right here in Reading. Happy holidays to everybody.